So women's rights organisations, women-led organisations are absolutely critical um, in crisis response because they were part of the community before crisis, during crisis, and um, they will be the people who remain after crises. And I think, you know, one of the things that the international system doesn't do well at is that we often come in and we drive a response and we find the actors, local actors, to plug into our response. Whereas I think we need to reframe um, that narrative and to let locals lead the local organizations, including women's organizations, lead, and then we come in with whatever that is needed, whether that's funding, partnerships, advocacy. I think, um, firstly, you know, we need to be very humble and acknowledge that um, a lot of response in crisis situations are being done by local actors, in particular women's organizations and networks. So they will do that whether there is funding or not. Right? They will often do it um, because they're part of the community and they're responding to a need. So whether we come to the table with money or not um, is inconsequential. Um, and I think that's a really humbling thing, right? However, having said that, providing the resources can really help you know, that organization to go a long way. So it allows them to scale up um, and it allows them to do things in a much more efficient way than, um, say, an international actor.